What we've done in the MSc in Inequalities and Social Science is two things. First of all, we've set up an entirely new course that's taught by people from across LSE's disciplines and departments. Alongside that, students take their choice of courses drawn from different departments, whether it's about the politics of redistribution, whether it's about gender and development, uh, whether it's about um, how social policies react to, to inequalities. I've always been interested in inequality and I think as public recognition has grown of uh, income inequality growing, I was trying to look for an experience that would allow me to analyze it from a multitude of perspectives and it seemed to me that the LSE Inequalities Institute was the best place to do that. I was a history major during my undergraduate studies and was very much focused on a lot of issues of race, gender and class and I felt that the inequalities program really had a good approach towards that in combining policy and academic research and theory um, and so I really wanted that holistic experience of analyzing social issues through that lens. I decided to study inequality because I'm from Mexico and it's such a problem there as it's in the world nowadays. It makes me realize that poverty is related to inequality so if we don't see inequality as a problem we wouldn't be able to fight poverty. I'm from Egypt and in the years preceding the Egyptian revolution we really had an upwards redistribution of wealth of power in Egyptian society. I came here to LSE in order to better understand how these inequalities emerge. Now I know that you can study inequalities from different disciplines and different perspectives. I think that it is important to understand that inequality uh, affects uh, different aspects of human, of human life. So I think the best part about the program in terms of moving forward, in terms of what we can do from it, is just a, a comprehensive understanding of what, how to solve a complex problem. I've always wanted to do something more socially responsible and I felt that economic inequality is something that particularly bothers me, especially globally. Here you get the chance to compare ideas, to think critically. You'll also be working with students who come from all sorts of different backgrounds, different parts of the world you'd have the chance to think creatively. It's given me an awareness of disciplines that I really had not considered before and of how they relate to each other. And it's also given me an awareness of how the institutions that I've spent my life in actually have been shaped and why they're kind of malfunctioning the way that they are. So it's been really good. I will try to go back to Mexico and work at the government where the, the debate is not that important now. It's truly expanded my quantitative uh, analytical abilities, uh, but also broaden my horizons in terms of how to approach problems from a multidisciplinary perspective. Well, I hope to work for either a think tank or international organization in which I can really focus on reducing social inequalities, so whether that be through research or policy making or data analysis, um, I hope to contribute to that in some way. I knew that inequality was a problem coming in, but learning from these academics and learning uh, at the LSC and in the International Inequalities Institute has more solidified the evidence behind why it's a problem. Um, and I think that's just going to further put me on a path to work in some capacity to try to solve it or reduce it in some way. So at the end of the course, we hope people will have a very strong understanding of how people have thought about inequality from different perspectives, the kind of tools that different disciplines can bring to bear on all the problems and all the interactions that are involved in it, and they can take that forward into their maybe academic careers or into their careers as practitioners, working in the kind of organisations and spaces uh, which have a bearing on how inequality affects everybody's um, future lives.